Hey guys, what's up? It's Josh from Epic Minecraft HD and GottaBeMobile.com, and today I'm just going to be showing you guys uh, how to make your own uh, my private Minecraft server for Minecraft Beta 1.7.3. So as you can see, this is what your sort of your final thing is going to look like with all these files and everything. But I'll show you step by step on Windows XP and Windows 7 on how to uh, create a, a regular Minecraft server. So what you want to do is first of all you want to open your Google Chrome, or your uh, web browser. I use Google Chrome because uh, then next you want to go to www.minecraft.net. Oops, sorry, I have caps on. Um, and next you want to go to the download area. Uh, you want to go all the way down where it says multiplayer multiplayer beta server software. You want to download that. If you're on Windows, download this, the EXE. If you're on any uh, Linux or Mac, download this. But so once you download that, uh, you're going to get a folder that looks sort of like you sort of like this, except without um, most of this stuff. It's going to just have world band IPs. Uh, it's going to have these and then server.log and uh, that's it. So what you, uh, you're going to get this application, Minecraft server, and then the Minecraft private server file. So uh, next, what you want to do is you want to just uh, leave that there, and you want to download something called Hamachi. Uh, Hamachi is it's like the IP address, it's the main IP address for your server, and this is how to get it for free. So um, we want to look up Hamachi on YouTube, and the website is. <coughs> <clears throat> securelogmein.com and then you want to click on unmanaged downloads please and then you want to confirm with use and then download and you can also download with Mac OS X version uh, so you want to download that and once you download it it's going to install and every if, with, with, as an MSI file and then you're going to this is going to open. It's going to say starting Hamachi and then open up something like this. So when uh, when you first get it, it's going to say 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, however, however many. And you want to press the power button and it's going to say, uh, it's going to find your IP address and you're going to want to say join, it's going to say join net, uh, create network or join network here. And then you would, and uh, if you screw up or something, you can always create a new network or join a network here. So let's just say that you press connect, create new network. I'm just going to name this one YouTube Tutorial World. And password, let's just make the password Happy Kimchi. Or no, Happy Monkey. Then press create. So this is going to be, it's going to look like this. And if you have a green dot next to it, then it's going to work. So uh, what you want to do now is you want to join that network, and so you're going to go back into your Minecraft private server thing. Uh, you want to go. You want to go into server. It's going to say at a at a properties file. Uh, if it has just a blank thing on it and it says Windows cannot find a program to execute this with, go to. Um, you want to. Click it and you're going to say uh, right click it and it's going to say open with and uh, open it with Notepad or WordPad, but I suggest Notepad. So what, you're going to open it and this is going to show up. So first of all, you want to change the uh, spawn monsters. If you are on peaceful, then you want to change that to true. Or uh, if you don't like monsters, then and you don't want that screwing up your world, uh, press false and everything. And then you're going to want this is going to be blank. So go back to your Hamachi uh, thing. And your IP address is going to here. You're going to put that in here, and then it's going to say uh, you're going to just change this. My settings are: I have the Nether to be true. View distance is 10. I like, or actually, I want to make it uh, tw 13. Uh, spawn monsters. I want that to be true. Online mode true. Spawn animals true. Max players. I want to actually have it at 64. Uh, server IP is your IP address uh, for, and then PVP is true. Uh, level seed, uh, you don't have to have it at anything. Server port is whatever it is. Uh, allow flight, so if you have like zombie flight mod, then you can have uh, flight. And whitelist, I like to have that at false. So you want to save it, and when you want to go back into your fo folder, and then you're going to see a lot of other options like ops. For example, these are my uh, 
operators in my server and I'm just going to for example I'm just gonna add something like it's gonna say a, a band player or something like that uh, and I put in some band players but uh, um, and the whitelist you wanna if your whitelist is soft then you can uh, get rid of that so and uh, I'm going to have two of my favorite maps down uh, in the description so that you can download it but um, on a and uh, and on a tutorial on how to, uh, if you don't like your regular world, you don't like the the island, then you can do like Minecraft Golf or Survival Island. Um, you guys can download any sort of map, and then what you want to do is when you download that, you want to drag it into your Minecraft private server file, and you're going to put the folder in here, and then you're going to go back into your uh, server properties file. And you're going to see this level name. For example, I, if I have it at survival, uh, world, and you're going to delete that, and you're going to change it to exactly what the Minecraft world says. So I'm going to change it to Minecraft Golf, and that's pretty much it. Uh, so you want to go back into Minecraft, and I don't think you have to have the full game in order to make a server like this. But uh, so you want to go into your Minecraft. Um, you want to go into your Minecraft folder, and then you want to go back into multiplayer, and you want to enter your in, enter your IP into the uh, server. Press connect. It's gonna say, oh, actually, you know what? I forgot something. Sorry. Um, you have to go into Minecraft private server, and I'm I'm such a <laughs> sorry about that. You want to go in. You want to open the Minecraft server .exe. Oh, I'm sorry for doing that. But then this is gonna show up. You're just gonna wait for it to say done like that done and then you want to keep this over for the to the side but uh so now you can close the minecraft private server folder uh and once you load this when it says done for help type uh help or question mark you can open up minecraft and log in and then what you're going to do is you're going to go to the multiplayer part and press connect and it's going to say logging in downloading terrain uh, and that's pretty much it. Alright guys, so here you go. Um, thanks for watching. Remember to rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, I really uh, ho I really want you guys to uh, give me some feedback on my videos. Uh, uh, for example, oop, that's a spider attacking me. Uh, but give me some feedback on my videos. I want you, I want to have some help. I'm gonna die for you guys over here. Oh man, I'm gonna die. Uh, uh, but anyway, I want thanks for watching. Remember to rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, go to my channel. Uh, go to my friend's channel, and I am Tim the Great uh, for awesome tech reviews. And that's pretty much it. So see you guys later. Peace.